Hi, and welcome to Masters of the Delta Blues Guitar with Kevin Duggan. That's King B by, um, I think it was written by uh, what, what's that, uh, uh, Slim Harpo, who played it on the piano, harmonica and everything. Did a great version. Might be a little bit different. That's my arrangement. It's not really Delta Blues. Uh, it's a 145 progression and uses some snappy sounds that are kind of familiar to Delta style playing, so it's influenced a little bit by Delta playing. Again, it's a 1-4-5 progression, and it's a, just a E, A. So I'm fingering my E up here with one finger. Oh, I could do two, but I'm doing one. So I'm getting, you know, I'm using staccato for this, the two, two bottom strings, you know, and, Stopping it. Coming on this string, which is your G note, and bending it. So, so what I'm doing is three fingers here, and so you have the you have your B string and you have your E string, so you can get a little bit of variation there. So slow, it's like this. So a little, another thing I'm doing at the beginning is add, adding the note in here, which is a great, you know, bending note. And I use it at the beginning. So what, what, what I am here is I'm on an A sharp on the G string, one, two, three. And I'm using the open E. So you could do it in simultaneously or like this. Or so that's whether you pull it down or push it up, you know, uh, sometimes pulling it down seems easier. That's A sharp, then back. Then just going up from the A up to the E, up to the B. So it's a pentatonic scale. Then up to the G note. Then I, you know, you take a three fingers and I'm grabbing the two bottom, high E, and the low E up top. So it'd be like. So, you know, you also have this. There's a whole bunch of little things you can throw in. Like, uh, Or if you wanted to, you know, and that's for your A. That's for your A. So when I get on to the A, I'm, you know, I'm. And one 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 thing about getting snaps out of the guitar just has to do with the the guitar itself. You know, some guitars, the action and everything are going to make it easier to snap. And once you get comfortable with it, you know, I I just want that noise in there, that that percussive sound. So I'm doing the same thing I was doing in E, basically, uh, with this. But in A, I'm... Then I 
again, you have the A sharp. So, you know, it's, it's that rhythm. Almost like a John Lee Hooker type rhythm, really. I'm bending it down, bending that C note down. Then, you know, uh, I guess I thought this was supposed to sound like a bumblebee, but I really don't think it does. But uh, this, uh, So then this other B part, you know, where you go into your five chord, you know, your E, your e is the one chord, A is the four chord, and then the turnaround chord uh, to go through the whole cycle again is this uh, kind of a B7 chord. What I'm doing is instead of a typical B7 where you, what I'm doing is using again that A sharp and then the B. It kind of has a great uh, dissonant noise. Then you can even throw in a C, what would normally be like a C bar, but you're just using some of the, you're just using some of the notes. So you go, you're going, I'm just using two fingers to fret there. So he, here it is, the whole thing. And down to the A. Or, So one more thing is using, again, you know, I'm using that A sharp a real lot. Even when I'm doing this E, the C chord in the beginning, I'm doing the, I'm doing the. So, so, so that's, I'm hitting A sharp, B. Then I'm hitting A sharp. You can hit A sharp, G, or A sharp. E or A sharp A or like that. You know, so there's a whole bunch of little, so that would sound like this. So that's basically that song. Uh, it's not. It's 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 a nice song. It, you know, a lot of uh, I guess you'd call them technical type things. Uh, my name is Kevin Doug, and this is Masters of Delta Blues Guitar. Although that was a, not exactly a Delta song, but <laughs> influenced by Delta style. Thanks. Bye.